show you just throwing it. It yeah, doesn't see. do anything with it. No, you just did. Oh, did I? Oh. Yeah. Do you see it counting down again? No. Not on my screen. Uh, try it again, then. Look at an enemy and press that button. Oh, okay, I see it now. Okay, got Yeah. It. Okay. Okay, so it has a, a one-time thing and a cooldown. Yeah. Okay. There are better equipments than that, so... That is a good equipment to have. That's one of the newer ones they've added. I did ping a chest right here for you. Since I got both the boss loot. Oh, those are really good. Uh, upon your hits, they attach a bomb to the enemy. Ooh. Yeah. Go ahead and snag this one up. There, you can have that. I already have a ukulele. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's going to help right. you deal more damage when there's a horde of enemies. So there's this other chest right here. This is a utility chest. So it's something that's not going to help with damage. It's going to help with something else. So this oh. red whip that I got lets me move faster when I'm not in combat. That's a stun grenade, so if you uh, you actually have a more stunning chance with your weapons. Okay. Um, there's another one up here I want to get to. Uh, here, on the other side of this, here's this right here. It's a terminal that lets you choose between three weapons. One of them, I would probably recommend getting this brooch right here that I have. So every time you kill something, you get a temporary barrier. Um. Oh, there it goes. Now to let me do it. Uh, there is a drone here for ninety-seven dollars. A missile drone. It'll just fly around and do what you think it does. It fires missiles at enemies. How do I select that one? Just. Uh, we. I don't know if you have enough. Oh, I don't. Uh, so, yeah. I don't think I do. Will tell you how much money you got. Watch out, there are these giant behemoth things. Little gongs that fling spike balls at you. Yeah, I think it said I don't have enough. There, oh. I'll buy them. And if you want to jump up here with me. Ugh. So jump onto the rock and then up top. There's another chest I want to show you. Okay, jump on the rock please. The other side here. Here we go. This is a healing chest. It will give you a weapon that will heal you in some shape or form. Hmm. A weapon Jeez, that will heal you. Dollars. So you can go ahead and buy that when you have enough. Yeah, that's just out of my range. I can't quite shoot him. So if Ow. you want that healing barrel, you can go ahead and uh, buy that. It's right on the other side of these rocks here. Yeah, I know. Just, uh, you do make have sure I got a roll that you can use, activate, and it'll help you roll away from damage, uh. so you can try and avoid it. Yeah, I've targeted or activated it a few times. <laughs> yeah. No. Yeah, the uh, faster we go through, the uh, like. It all depends on how you want to play it. Mm -hmm. If you want to go straight for yeah. teleporters every time, or if you want to like try to beef up your character. 
I normally go for beefing up my dude because that's gonna allow me to live longer. That's your guy. Here, uh, you can go ahead and buy that one now. Huh. So you can buy stuff while you're in combat, which is what I do. I, if I run by a chest and I'm being chased by enemies, I just buy the chest if I can, and then I just run by and grab the item once I have enough time. The items technically do not despawn until you leave the stage. Okay. Good to know. So you can always just buy one and then circle back to get it if you are getting overrun by enemies. Ooh, this is a relic. So the frost relic I just picked up, if I kill enemies, it surrounds me with an ice storm. Ooh. So this uh, ice field I have yeah. actually does damage to enemies now. Nice. That will activate every time I kill something. So not only do I get that temporary barrier from the brooch, I also get this as a barrier. Here's another terminal. I'll leave a barrel, a cash barrel for you. Let's see. So, I don't remember what the monster tooth does, but I know this fresh meat heals you. And there's also a mystery terminal. So, mm. the one that will give you just a random item. That's a mystery one. Alright, go ahead and buy it. That's giving you a flag. So, every time you level up, it drops a war banner. Inside the war banner, you get higher attack damage and I believe speed. Uh. Uh, here's another cash barrel for you. I'm gonna go over this way because I think I found myself an equipment ah. barrel. Nice. There is fall damage too, by the way. Okay, so I got a volcanic ache. So I'm gonna show you what that does once I get closer. So, my fall candy cake lets me turn into this. Ow. I turn into just three fireballs that gives the ability to detonate, and then glitch me underneath the map. Nice. Apparently. <laughs> Wasn't aware that was going to happen, but okay. Alright. It's not the best ability <laughs> to have. I don't like the ability, but... It's an okay equipment. Um, here's another uh, barrel for you, a chest. I'm gonna grab this one. So I got will o wisps If I kill an enemy, it detonates their body. I just make enemy bodies explode now. <laughs> Very nice. And you got another sticky bomb. So that, uh, I believe, up either if it stacks, I think it adds another sticky bomb or it just ups the damage. There is another chest right under there for you. Oh, cool. I got myself a sticky bomb too. Uh, Rose Buckler. Um, I'm not 100% sure what that one does. I do not remember. There's way too many uh, items for me to try and memorize them all. Uh, I did ping a normal barrel for you, which should give you some more cash. Oh, uh, there. Okay. And since I don't like mm. my equipment, I'm gonna try and swap it out. 
Ah, disposable missile launcher. So every time I activate this, it just fires a swarm of missiles. Very nice. Oop. And you will see in the bottom left, it has your health and what level you are. But I think we might be ready to start the teleporter event. Let's see if I can find any more like around the backside here. Oh, so you decided to swap your saw blade for the, yeah. Oh. I think your saw marine's gonna be better than that think volcanic so. egg. You can only have one activated uh, ability at a time. Okay. There's nothing down there. Anything this way. I'm gonna go up. Um, there's another chest. My for you. secondary weapon is actually pretty brutal too. Yeah. Found another chest for you. It's just semi-difficult to get up here. Uh, yeah, I just tried to jump like that. There you go. Oh, I made it. <laughs> uh, missile mark one. I think that will just, like, fire a missile every now and then, or something like that. Okay, um, here's another one. So if you want to go up there, there is a chest for you. I'm going to go this way and grab the one I found over here. Let's buy another, uh, another gunner drone. Oh, the Hopo Feather gives you a double jump, I believe. Or makes you jump higher, which is really nice. Uh. I just got myself a war banner. But yeah, as you progress and get stronger and more health, so do the enemies that you are fighting. Okay. And then on, once you get to a certain difficulty, you will encounter like two, maybe three bosses at a time without activating an, another event when you activate the teleporter. Oh, okay. So they do that to raise the difficulty even higher. Yes. See if I can find that teleporter again. I thought it was up there. Is it not up there? Yeah, I think we are good to go once we find it. So it's not on this hill. Which means it's gonna be. Ah, found it. It is over this way. And you do not have a range on your weapons either, so I can technically Oop. shoot all the way across the map. Oh, really? Yep. Wow. Like, uh, the enemy you are shooting, I'm also shooting him from where I am. <laughs> so, if you want to... So, once you head over here, I'll, we can go ahead and start the teleporter. All right, and that way. All right. So you want to go ahead and stand over there and activate it? 
Are you ready for it? Yep. All right, another stone titan. So I would recommend standing inside these uh, war banners that we have placed. That way we attack faster and stronger. There we go. And now, since it drops two of each, we both get one. Okay, so the Rose Buckler reduces incoming damage if you're sprinting. So while you are running, you have reduced damage. So now all we need to do is hold out by this teleporter until it hits 100% charge. Hmm, all right. Just take on whatever comes near us. And every time you, like, if you die and start over, every time you start over, the layout is always different. Oh, okay. It will always, well, like, the layouts per stage will be a different map. Hmm. So you won't necessarily, if we do another round, we won't get the same two stages in a row. Ah. Uh. And there are, like, more difficult stages as you progress. Uh, here, come get this lore book that's right here. Got it. And then when if we both die, I will show you how to activate the lore book so you can see what each creature is and what it does. But you can go ahead and enter the teleport now if you are ready. So that gives us experience in the bottom left, and it will take mm. our money. And away we go. Yep. Stage number three. Okay, so that's one. That's another stage done. Right. This is my least favorite stage because of the boss that spawns here. Oh. Uh. Oh, these are new, new altars that I found. If you have a blue lunar coin, so the one I showed you in the first stage, you can also activate these. Uh. But I recommend just stockpiling them. And saving up to buy the, uh, I think he's the Artificer, who's trapped in time, technically. So that's a 248 large chest. Let's see. I want to try to find a Shrine of Chance and a Blood Altar so I can show you those, but I don't see any. Oh, there's a new enemy for you. He'll be making his way over here. All right, do we have enough? Okay, so if you want, you can go ahead and open up that large chest over there. And I'll take one of the smaller ones. Ooh, I got an energy drink, which allows me to sprint faster. Uh, Another stealth kit. Yeah, so you turn stuff. it invisible upon taking heavy damage. Ooh. And here is a new enemy. And same with this guy, another war banner. So if you look that way that I'm shooting, you'll see a giant wisp. Those guys can be a pain in the butt and you need to watch out for these dudes as well. Because they'll shoot stuff and they can also, if they get close to you, they pretty much ground pound the ground like Hulk and flings you into the sky. Mm. Um, this looks, oh yes, my favorite equipment. 
So this is a, an equipment terminal. It gives you a cube that's pretty much a black hole. It pulls enemy towards it. It will give you a chrysalis, uh, Malky chrysalis, which get, grants you wings temporarily, or the ocular HUD, which increases crits. Ooh. But I'm, uh, <laughs> you need 248 to choose one of those. So if you want to change out your saw blade for one of those, you can go ahead once you hit 248. Okay. Need a These bit more dudes that. are annoying because they just teleport all the time. There we go. You should have enough now if you wanted to change your equipment. Hmm. So you can either grant wings temporarily and fly. I believe that's increased crit or a black hole that pulls enemies away from you and towards the black hole. I think I like the black hole idea. But... And now we have these gunners. Well, let's get rid of these first. <laughs> guys have freaking Gatling guns. Alright. So go ahead and buy your... Uh, Alright, these are... Um, the cube is the one, right? I need that. Yes, the primordial cube. Primordial cube, okay. Got it. Uh, nope, you have to come over and oh. swap it now. There, there you go. go. Now I'm going to take your saw blades. Because that's better than my missile launcher. All right, now let's move on. We believe we got everything in this section. There we go. And it looks like we have another equipment one, which grants another cube. Okay, I'll take a cube myself. Sweet. All right, let's see. What does this one have? Uh, okay. Um, go ahead and grab this cautious slug and tell me what that does. I believe that's a healing item. Uh, rapidly heal outside of danger. Okay, so when you are not being attacked anymore, you will rapidly heal. So your regen goes up. And that is the black hole. So no matter what, if they try and teleport out of it, they keep getting stuck back in. Keep getting stuck back in. Nice. And I'm gonna go down and around this way. Um, let's see, what's down here? Ah, what's that? A jade elephant? You can think that gives you a temporary bonus, and there's also multi terminal here. Nope. Get out of here. So you can go ahead and pick one if you want. I'm gonna see what the jade elephant does. Okay. Gain a massive armor for five seconds. Eh. Choose the mystery item. Yeah. Focus crystal. I think that is for crit. This way, see what we can find over here. Doesn't look like there's anything this way anymore, so let's just head on back and kill these guys. There we go. Yeah, it spawned some pretty meanies there. <laughs> yep. Hmm. 
Mm -hmm. Uh, go ahead and grab those two money barrels that's up ahead. I'm gonna see what's inside this equipment. This is an Ocul HUD. Yeah, the Ocul HUD gives you 100% critical strike for t 8 seconds. So, some people like to go for that, but I don't have anything that, like, really increases your crit damage. So, it's mm. okay, but not worth it in my book. In my opinion, at least, I don't think it's worth it. Black hole's really good to help get out pinches when you're surrounded by enemies, so. And for when there's a lot of enemies and you're on a map like this, you can just activate it towards the cliff and drag them off the side and they just fall and die. Oh, nice. So it's a very tactical item to have. And here's one of the things I wanted to show you. A Shrine of Chance. So you pay for money, and you might get a weapon out of it. So I'll go ahead and take this weapon, and then you keep paying for it, because it goes for two weapons. Oh, okay. So you have a chance to get an item. So, mm. yep. so that one didn't want to give you any. So if you buy it again... So you keep on going until it actually gives you an item. If it doesn't give you one this time, I'll go ahead and buy it for you. There you go. There it is. I think that slows enemies on hits. Horrible slows enemy on a hit. Yep. Yep. Okay. Another. Uh, let's see if they get a good equipment. Oh, that one's just a heal on use. Not that amazing. That's it. Get out of here. <laughs> All right, now uh, we need to use these little jump pads to go any further. So, perfect. Let's blood shrine. Yes. Oh, I missed. So, if you do not die, if you fall off the map, it'll just take some health from you and then put you back on the side. Yeah, it teleported me back. So how do I... Okay, so I jumped when I hit that, but it didn't uh, fall You own. just run over it. You don't have to really do anything. So I can just hit it, and it automatically makes me jump. Okay, so you gotta be running for that though, right? Yeah, you just run into it. And that's all you have to do. Oh, okay, so there I didn't... Go. Yeah, so I needed to be in the run mode. Yeah. So this shrine right here is really good if you have a way to regen. This shrine, if you give it 50% of your health, it will give you money. So you have healing items. Once all these enemies are cleared, go ahead and activate that shrine. If I froze, that's fine. Oh. Uh. You can go ahead and knock that, activate that shrine now. It should be good. So it just gave you 134 gold for 50% of your health. Oh. So it's a good way to get gold early on. Yeah. Especially when it's like just starting out or you have a lot of ways to get <laughs> health back. Um, here, since I bought the first shrine chance, you can buy this one when it's cheapest. Lone Survivor. Uh, fail after this shrine change three times. I believe that will give you a, first a new character. Hmm. So go ahead and buy it again because it didn't give you an item. Got nothing. So you just. Do you have enough money for it one more time? Nope. Nothing nope. again. Damn. So every time you fail, it just keeps getting more expensive. So I'll let you keep going, and then once it hits, once you get your item, I'll buy mine. So you can get the cheapest item, if it wants to give you any. Nothing. 
So you just got a thing for failing at it three times in a row called is this bug. Four times in Nothing a row. Again. Jeez. Just trying to chance it's not working. All right, there we go. Do you have 446? Uh, yes. Nothing, got nothing. All right, let's just... Here. Let me waste some money on it. Uh, I'm not wasting any more money on that one. So yeah, it's now up to $1,222. Yeah. I've already wasted about 1000 on it. Yeah. Okay. So, um, here, a personal shield generator. It's on the backside. There you go. Ooh. There you go. Now you have a That'll shield. That'll help. Uh, let's see what I get for this one. Kill all nearby allies for standing still for two seconds. So if I stand still for two seconds, I can heal you if you're near me. Very nice. Uh, that's how you get up. Okay. Oh, come on. Get out of here. Another equipment. It's, ah, that just gives you flying wings. That's. It can be useful, but not as useful as this black hole. I really wish I had that double jump. Uh, oh, here we go. Here's a damage chest, so it will guarantee you an item that helps with damage. Try tip dagger. I think that will increase. Mm. Uh, that get, has a chance to bleed your enemies. All right. So let's go further. Here's There's a new barrel for you for money. Finally, a health item. Heal outside of danger. Thank you. Finally, heal. And I found another shrine of chance. If you want to waste money. I'm good for now. All right, well, here's a chest over here. And then once you get this chest, I believe that'll be everything, so we will be good to go. Come on. Did you just fall? Oh, I don't have enough. Oh, there you are. Oh, there it is. There you go. It's another topaz brooch. Oh, I probably had enough after killing those guys. <laughs> well, it's right behind you. Thank you. Yep. All right. Now if we continue on this way. We be able to make it back to the teleporter. And if you look at your character, you'll see all the items you have on your character. So it's not only just there for helping you, it's also visual. Mm. Makes your character look kind of cool. And it's just right on the other side of this. Yep. Stupid teleporters, get out of here. Ah, stupid 
Beetle. I'll go ahead and activate this one. And what boss do we get? Okay, back up. This boss hurts. This boss can do some serious damage. He keeps like sucking me into him. Yeah, it's his uh, chains attack he's using. Okay, the Swiss has to go. You gotta go. There we and go. And down. All right. Awesome. And we got a really good item for the teleporter events. Periodically releases a healing nova during the teleporter event. So just randomly it will activate this healing wave that goes by and heals us. Oh, nice. And now we just got a new character because we did a teleporter event three different times. So when you are ready, we can go ahead and proceed to stage four. Is there anything else here we need to do or are we good? Nope, we should be good. All right, stage four. <laughs> right as we get attacked. <laughs> Siren's call. All right. Ooh, a feather. Cool. I kind of want that. Here, you can go ahead and get that damage chest, and I'll get this feather when I have enough. Oh boy. There is a special boss for this area too, if we want to activate him. And if we activate him, we get some really nice rewards. Uh. Oh wow, I just got like thrown up in the air. Yeah. This guy's hurt on this one. If you check the difficulty we're at, we're at an insane difficulty. Have the bird down. Okay, give me that feather. Thank you. You can go ahead. You should have enough for that chest now. Oh, I can't repair that tur turret. Damn. Okay, another sticky grenade. Bomb. Um, let's see what's up here. Here you go. Apparently, I'm now live again. Okay. Yeah, Twitch is doing some weird things on my end, too. Yeah, it said that I stream went offline and then all of a sudden I'm back online. Whoa there. Uh, oh, here's a chest for you up here. A hey, frog looking thing, get over here. Just 222 one? Ooh, I don't know what that does. Hmm, Gore's Tome. I'm gonna go down below. Please something good. <laughs> Another ukulele. How wonderful.
And back up. Too many enemies. I did find a terminal though. Oh yeah? Yep. Let's see, um, I recommend getting the thing I've pegged already. That's an old war stealth kit. Yeah, get this one. That is a leeching seed. I believe that lets you take uh, mm. take health from enemies. Oh, you went too far below. I'm trying to see where you went. Oh, you're back over Come there. Back a little bit. Okay, I found you. Oh my god. These guys are pain. These guys hurt. Yes, they oh. do. Ow. And right, they took me uh, down. Looks like I'm fine. That leeching, I don't even have enough. Whoops. Okay, this <laughs> might be where we die. Alright, freeze power. Yep. 51 minutes. Right. Mm. Defeat. So this gives you Way a chance four. to look at are all the points we got, mm. what you, was killed you, what you've unlocked, okay. and the items you've collected. Uh, so kills 174. Minions killed zero. Deaths two. Damage dealt 115,000. That attracts quite a bit. Yeah. Well, for it being your first run, that was not that bad. <laughs> I was crushed, and you were shot to death, basically. Yeah, I'm. Mine just says you are dead, yours says crushed. Crushed. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's go ahead and hit continue. And here we go, we have a new hero we can be. A new survivor. Ooh. Um. Uh, I pressed the wrong button. No. I don't want to do that. Hold on, let me re-invite you, because for some reason it took me too far out. You exited. There we go. <laughs> yep. Don't know why it wanted me to do that, but here we go. Okay. See more yet. Alert. Alright, and now we'll do start private game again. Alright, here we go. We got the Huntress, who uses a bow and arrow. I like her better. If you select her, you can see mm -hmm. what skills she has compared to the skills the Commando has. I don't see a new one unlocked. So you only see the Commando still? Yeah. Only across the top, right? Yeah. Yeah, I see the commando, and I it just says oh, okay. requires so actually, to be alone, complete. or yeah, okay. requires warrior. That makes sense. Then you have to reach and complete the third teleporter event without dying. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. so then we just got to go in and try to make you last that long without dying. Yeah. All right. Are you ready for another go? I'm ready. All right, here we go. Distant Roost. Oh, you spawned all the way up there. Jeez. Oh, wow. Hello. Oh, this one fires slow. I forgot. Oh, but I can teleport. That's nice. Can I get over to you? Okay, we'll find my uh, way. Yeah, there's a way down, I believe. What can I find here? And a healing thing up here. 50 HP. I think I did too. Regenerate health after killing an enemy. Okay. So go ahead and buy whatever ones you can find uh, on your way down. And I'll a ukulele. Try to make my way up to you. There we go. Let's 
see. Okay, I don't think I'm going the right way to catch up with you, maybe. maybe, maybe. Uh, I'm trying to circle around. Hmm. Uh, just teleport that way. Wait, I see you. Hello. Hey, there we are. Here, buy that. That might help keep you alive. <laughs> there we go. This Huntress is not one of my favorite ones to use. She's better than the Commando. Stronger? Yeah, here. There's a healing chest for you. And you came from all the top, so I don't know. So we need to go this way. There's still a, a chest up there, I just couldn't afford it. Oh. Like 42. Right. Let's go see what it is. <coughs> oh, a blood shrine too. Oh, there is a chest here. There's also a t turret. I'll buy the turret. Why not? Was it all the way up at the very top where he yep. Okay. Yeah, there was one up there, it was like 55. Wow, 42 gold for losing half my health? Not even worth it. Oh, the blood shrine? Yeah. Oh, um, here, I found another healing drone for you. All the way up here. Oh, that you get the healing drones. That way, you, hopefully, you can live till the third teleporter wave. And you can unlock this person. Grab these. Critical strike chance dealing double damage. Okay. I found a teleporter. And I found an equipment barrel for you all the way down here. If I could mark it. There we go. So since my guy has a teleporting ability, I pretty okay. much just jump teleported down here. Mm. So if you jump and then activate your roll at the same time, you might take less damage, or t no damage. But that would be a huge risk for your health. You just gotta make your way back on down. Flyers. Uh, I don't remember how to unlock that door. Oh well. Okay, you went all the way back down? Yep. Uh, I'm trying to mark that equipment. There we go. All right, we're going our way back down there. Actually, with the two healing drones, I could I could do the blood uh, yeah. blood shrine and. I have a fuel cell for you too. Is hey, that yeah? They're healing me right back up. Yep. That's why I like getting the healing drones. They're really helpful. Bought a chest for you and gave me something that. Uh, you should have. I 
103 gold. That was pretty good, but took most of my, my health. Yeah, but it took almost all of my health to do it. Yep. Because I already hit it once. Oh, did you? Uh, yep. Like here, I can go ahead. It goes all the way up to 90% of your health. Wow. That's a lot. Yeah. All right, I'm coming. All right. Here's a fuel cell for you. Go ahead and grab that and read off what it does. Additional equipment charge reduces equipment cooldown. Perfect, because here is an equipment barrel, barrel for you. So do exactly what I thought it would. 50% health. Do that. And that did a foreign fruit. That also heals. And that is everything, because this one was a smaller map. So when you're ready, we can start the teleporter event. Well, let's go ahead and get it started. Here we go. Okay, this guy, you got to be careful. He does an ability where if you're not behind something, it will hurt really bad. Okay, get behind some, uh, not down. Never mind, he wasn't doing it. Why won't you activate your other ability? He's gonna probably save oh, it. No, oh, no, I went geez. down. The minions on the ground got me. Alright. Oh, he just did his ability, it sucked you in, didn't he? No, it's not the one I was talking about. I don't know no. if he wants to activate it. I accidentally teleported up to him, which was the issue. Oh, okay. Oh, that ability, right there. That one. I need to get behind something, or that takes half. Yeah, that hurt. Okay. There we go. Well, as it is, that boss already took me down. Well, the minions yeah. took me down. But I was focused more on the boss, so that was my mistake. I didn't focus. I mean, I, I honestly didn't. forgot about the minions, too, so. Yeah. It's just they all decided to hoard you and not me. Well, here, I found a chest to start you off. <laughs> Never mind, that's not a chest, that's a turret. Uh huh. Okay. Hey, look, another equipment. $61. Yeah, with this character, I actually have a range I can hit. So I can't just cross map hit people. Mm. Unless I use it an ability like that. I do that yet. Here we go. Oh, that just gives me the volcanic egg. I'll give you a bummer. It's one of my least favorite things. One lunar. I have a lunar. Or do I need a lunar item? I think I need a lunar item. Dang. Although I do see a chest for you. Let's see what we got. Glasses. Lens maker glasses. Change to critically 
right? Doing double damage. It gives me a chance to do double damage. Nice. No. Oh. Uh. Give me that. Thank you. Now I have a daisy which will periodically release a healing nova during the teleporter event. Nice. Ow, that hurt. Hello. a chest right there and there's also one right there yeah let's see if we can get there And personal shield generator. Nice, nice. Um, here you go. Fresh meat. Guarantee you health on kills. Health on kills. Ooh. Yes, that was a, that's a good one. Right. So the here more I go. kill, the more health I get. Yep. Here, have some armor plating. Or, actually, here, you can have that. I'm going to take this one. Receive flat damage reduction from all attacks. And I got you another healing drone. For $97. Ooh. And there's another chest right there. We do this one. Okay, another personal shield generator. I just got another brooch for myself. Hey, look, another healing drone. So I think the next round, I'm probably gonna feed all the items into you, <laughs> so that way you have a higher chance of surviving till round three to unlock this character. If we get to, I think, tier uh, stage 7, there's an obelisk we can obliterate ourselves. It'll end our run, but it'll unlock another character as well. Huh. And there is an item. There is a character where you have to take this special item to get him to a certain stage. And if you fall below half your health, you go kaboom. Really? Yep. It's actually in your drop pod when you first start out. Huh. Okay. <laughs> yeah. You have to get him to a certain stage and hope the stage shows up and get to the very top of it to unlock him. And he's pretty much a plant robot that's all about health regen. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. If he goes um, down no, to half health, then he blows up. Yeah. Okay, well, cautious. Well, he doesn't, but the item that you have to take up there to repair him, mm -hmm. if you get below half health with that item in your inventory, oh, you then will blow up. You blow up. Got it. Yeah. It's difficult to do. But the that one is, like, my favorite character. He is very overpowered. And... He uses health to deal damage, but he also steals health from enemies when he's stealing damage. Oh. So yeah. He takes more health than he loses. If you stack that guy with a bunch of like healing items too, he's even more strong. <laughs> nice. Oh, 
poor little dude, you're stuck in this wall. This egg up here looking thing up on top. Yeah. It's just another lunar pod, but I'd rather save uh, my lunar points. Alright, turret helps out here. Come on, jump up, please. Up on the rock. Up here. Thank you. Aha, found a chest. There you go. Would you rather have the chest or another healing drone? Um, well, I got like five healing drones now, so probably the chest. All right, then I'll take the healing drone. <laughs> you can have that chest. Can I get up there? Probably not. I'm not on the other side anyway. Yeah. Oh, you're you're on the other side. Yeah. That's not what I want. There you go. And I think that should be it. So, and I just found a teleporter. If you're ready. That's another shield generator. Well then. You're gonna have a lot of shield. They, so they do stack? Yeah, they stack. Oh, yeah, they do. At the bottom. Wow. All right. Uh, go ahead and activate it when you are ready. All right. Do it. And what do we get this time? Oh, another one of these guys. Goody. Root. Oh. Kill it before it wants to activate the ability? Nope. Oh boy. That hurt. Alright, uh, go ahead and get both those items. So, I believe the loop is when you're at low health, it releases a fire nova. Mm. Is that everything we need here, or just the... What? I think that's everything we need here, right? Yep. Should be. There we go. It is fully charged. Go ahead and uh, activate ready? the portal when you're ready. Starting. And away we go. <laughs> Stage three. Back to scorched area. Acres again. How nice. All right. Wait a minute. Why is okay? I'll get broadcast. How? That was a little too far of a fall. Okay, it started me kind of on top here. Yep. Please give me a better item. Yeah, missile launcher. Thank goodness. Get out of here.
We are being hunted. Uh, all those gunner drones I have will kill them. <laughs> Two hundred seven dollars for an adaptive chest. Adaptive? Whatever that is. Go for it. Can't do it yet. No. Gotta get some more kills first. Yep. Here we go. Oh, someone spawned in. No, they died instantly. There you are. Now I can. Oh, it's giving you a whole bunch of options. Well then. Well, I guess it just, I take, grab, select it, and it gives me one of those. Oh. Got a monster, monster tooth. Monster tooth. So drop a healing orb or on kill. Nice. Every time you kill something, it drops an orb that will heal you if you pick it up. Here, let's see. Is this going to be any good? Do you want that healing fruit or would you like the cube? Um, well, if, if the healing orbs do their job, then I won't need the, right. the fruit. So there's a cube right there for you. Okay. There you go. Well, actually, that's going to lose the... Well, you're going to go ahead and take the fruit then. Uh, I have and... a missile launcher. Oh, do you? Yeah. So I'll, I'll go ahead and keep the fruit then because the, we'll try the healing orb. I'll try... The, I'll run with the healing orb for a little bit. Yeah, that work. Alright, then I'll go ahead and swap out my missile launcher for this cube. Oh, I'm surprised I made that jump. <laughs> Teleporter ability this person has is quite nice. One equipment. Oh, no, mm. I'm not using that. Nope. Mm -mm. I know what I'm going to do, though. I'm going to go grab that missile launcher, swap it for the cube, come back, give the missile launcher to that guy, and then go grab my cube. here there's two of them so we'll do this ocular hud one of those equipment drones there go go now let's go get that missile launcher back for the other equipment Okay, I got some good kills going on over here now. That should help. I'm just running back and forth right now to get both of these equipment drones. <laughs> Which, I'm gonna get the last one here and then go pick up my cube again. Nice. There we go. So those two should automatically activate their abilities when they're ready, hopefully. I think that's how they work. Not too sure. Mm. I don't use them. Thank you for my cue. Alright. And nope. Oh, I got frozen. And almost yeah. tossed off the edge. So here's the jump pad. We need to get lower. Hey, I got reward. Med kit. Here you go. Have a brooch. When if you want to jump back over. Aha. <laughs> uh -huh. There you go. Thank you. Oh, I got frozen on that. Killed that guy. 
Okay, now I gotta and jump back over there. I had two extra charges of your utility skill. Reduce the utility skill. Oh, interesting. Yeah, now we gotta jump back over. Alright. Um, let's see what's in here. Here, come get that. That'll be nice for you to have. Let's see what it does. Uh, stuck. There we go. Pick the armor piercing rounds up and read it off. Armor piercing rounds deals extra damage to bosses. There you go. So by bosses, it means like the teleport event. Mm, large Those chest. Big guys. Uh, yeah. And you got a race whip. Nice, nice. Red whip. Move faster or fast out of combat. Oh, okay. Let's see what's in this one. All right, I'm getting myself a personal shield generator. Oh, I froze, got frozen right as I was getting out. Oh, wow. So now I can teleport <laughs> three different times. What's this uh, donut thing that's in here? That's the lunar coin. Oh, the lunar coin. Yep. So I can, you can pick those up? Yeah. Oh, okay. They're uh, for the lunar shop that hmm. a certain portal will appear for it. When you open up the lunar pods, it's just it's best to save up lunar coins until you have a few of them. I believe 10 is how much the new character cost that's in the lunar shop. Uh. So I just save up until I have like 11 or 12 and then I'll try and open up the portal. Looks like that's everything down there. Time to continue on further. Teleporter is not in a good spot because that's too many cliffs. Uh, okay. So here, let me mark this one for you. The med kit. Well, I gotta get up where you're at because you teleported yeah. up where I can't get up to you. Get up to you yet. I gotta go run and get back up there. this bridge oh that stuck there's a terminal right down here <laughs> so just pick any of those three hmm Med kit. Receive a delay after the heal after taking damage. And there's two more chests once you can make it all the way up top for you. it up this way. Nope. Oh, you can. I did, yeah. And then down here, there's some chest. Two in a line for you.
Repulsion armor plate. And more glasses. Critical hit glasses, yeah. An incinerator drone. Hmm, okay. Alright, well that's everything on this stage. Are you ready to try and get to stage four? Yeah, let's try it. Oh no. Uh, watch out. Okay. Well, almost down. Yeah, I'm almost down too. Oh almost god. Down. Okay. Go ahead and get yours on the other side. Um this one? Or what? Oh on uh, the other side of the item. there. Yeah. Ah, got it. That guy almost killed me. Even with your healing bot? Yep. Mm. Not enough of them, huh? Nah, uh, but he also hits really hard and this one attacks slow. Oh, yeah. does more damage. So I attack slower than you, but I do more damage. Got it. And I don't have unlimited range like he has. Alright. Uh, go ahead and uh, let's enter the teleporter. Oh, I thought I hit it. There we go. Okay. Range four. Round four. <laughs> Oh, I don't like this one. Okay. We're gonna have magma worms. Magma worms? Yep. That doesn't sound healthy. Oh, just fell down. Okay, I made it. Yep. They are not. And they are annoying. Fight! Oh. And we also have these lizards that... Oh goodness, one came up behind me and almost knocked me all the way off. Do you get picked up? You kind of do. Oh god, oh god, how many freaking lizards? Go! Teleport out of here! No, teleport out of here! And we have a stone titan boss too. Oh gosh. You guys hurt, you guys hurt. Okay, one of the lizards is down. Oops, a chance. Hey, why is that lizard running in air? All of them are. Did the game crash or are they actually running in air? Oop. Oof. These guys hurt. And I didn't get anything to help with damage. That's just cool. I heal rapidly outside of combat. Uh. Let's get this drone. turret. Why not? I've marked a chest for you. 
Yeah, I was getting some serious lag, or these things are like floating in air. Uh, that happens. That actually happens when a lot of these guys are in the same area. And it's normally always this map. Uh, but this game is also still considered early access. Uh, Hoopoo Feather. In extra jump. Yeah, that's actually really helpful. This way, and this way, and this way. You uh, kill this big dude. These lizards are annoying and they hurt. Alright. Uh, oh, ow. <laughs> Something hit me and I... Oh, there you are. Hello. Almost got the drop on me. Almost? <laughs> Close. Uh, these are both the same, so they'll both open one. Another daisy. Uh, cautious slug. I'll take you. A missile drone. Yay. Look, another missile. Oh, I don't have enough for that missile drone. Dang it. I do. Nice. Um, what about. What's this way? Uh, what's this other box over here for? Oh, that's the printer you were talking about, right? Yeah, it's another printer. 